Hi, we are at Lebo Penang and we are now standing right in front of the Penang Chinese Chamber of Commerce building which is built in 1928. Uh, we're going across to number two, Irama Dining for today. Come, let's go. Irama Dining is located on the second floor and there's a lift lobby here so we can take the lift up to the restaurant. Come on. Oh, I'm going to scan to go in. It's great that they're having a proper protocol here. I'm done, Peter. Okay, we're done. Robert, after you. Okay, thank you. Oh, we are here. What a nice place, eh? Yeah, I'm Robert too. Nice to meet you. How are you? Hi, I'm Peter. How are you? How about the menu? Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. There's a nice mural or painting. Uh, you know, you have any idea who does it or? Yes, it's what? by it's by a local mural artist called Mandy Mount. Uh -huh. She's have several of these kind of large uh, murals on the wall that she's done. I think there's also one at Lagenda uh -huh. that was done yes, by her. Yes. Okay. By the way, Robert, yeah. I want to show you something. This restaurant actually overlooks the old Esplanade in Penang. Would you like to have a look yes, at yes, the view? Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah it'll be interesting. let me show you. Yeah, it'll be interesting. Watch your step. Thank you. Oh, what a lovely view, eh? Yes. From here. You can see the green fields of the old Esplanade. And the Penang Town Hall and the City Hall are just here on my left. Okay, I'm going to have a bit of this rice. I think it's from uh, the Asurai and Pandan. Okay? Mm, followed by the beef. Oh, it's so tender, eh? The rib is so tender. Try the tempura. I want to try this. So this is the prawn tempura, which uses uh, fermented, fermented durian. durian. You can durian. smell it from here. <laughs> and the color yellow, I think, is from the turmeric. Yes. Yeah. But this is one of my favorite curries. Eh? Mm. Yellow curry. One of my favorite curries. So though the prawn has shell but it's quite easily removed because they have uh, they've done cuts on it already so they cut off the tail and the head mm. i think the tempoya although it's fermented durian but the uh, Pandanus is not that strong. Eh? Yeah, yeah, I was about to say, mm -hmm. it's quite mild. Yeah, quite mild. So that's good for people who doesn't, you know, have not mm -hmm. tried tempoya before mm -hmm. and had some reservations whether is it going to be too strong. Shall we try the fish? Okay. Mm. Again, they use the ulam raja. Okay. I'm going to take one of the parcels and try. So the banana leaf wrapping, I think, uh, blends the fragrance to the dish when they grill it and inside you can see the the pais maramandi is uh, marinated with spices and maybe coconut milk mm. you have to try this robert okay this is very good the fish is moist mm -hmm. and you can see that they've actually marinated quite well maybe you know, very much in advance before they wrap it into the banana leaf okay. and then they pan grill it. So when they grill it, in a way the banana leaf protects the fish meat from drying out. I'm going to try a small mm, Very portion. nice. Very I'm, nice, very I'm nice. quite full from this meal already. I think I prefer this than the bringing rice. Hmm. Eh? Very aromatic oh. because of all the, the use of fresh turmeric. Yeah. Mm. Delicious. So, Robert, what's your favorite dish today? I mean, I thought all the dishes, even the rice dishes, are fantastic, but 
if that's a favorite, what would you pick? I would definitely have to pick the poya. The poya, the poya. Yeah. Yeah. My favorite was the beef rendang. Okay. I thought that was fantastic. It's so soft, and you can see that they took a lot of care in preparing mm. the, the beef yeah. rendang. Yeah, exactly. But um, I always love the they call it the yellow curry. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So, but this one has got the poya. It's a little bit special. So all in all, would you recommend that people make sure that they make a stop? Well, yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah. I felt so too. Mm -hmm. Because not just the food is fantastic, I think it's got fantastic ambiance and fantastic service. The beautiful mural by Mandy Mount is a plus. Yeah. Okay guys, if you are ever in Penang, if you are around this area especially, where you can visit the Fort Cornwallis, as well as the old courthouse, yeah, Irama Danning is a place that you might want to drop by and taste, have a taste of Malay traditional fine dining. It's about the only one in Penang. Fantastic food, don't miss it.